Today we're gonna be reviewing the worst restaurants in Illinois, and I brought my boyfriend and my girlfriend with me today. What did he say? Oh, oh. oh say hello. Oh we did some research on these restaurants. I found the top three in the area. We're gonna go head out to one right now. All right, so the first one is called, Javi, how do you say that? Camaroncito. Loco restaurant. Yeah. So we're headed out there right now. It currently has 1.3 stars on Yelp. We'll go through the reviews when we get there. So we just rolled up to this restaurant and it's him boarded up completely. The cell phone it, it's that red building right back there. So it says it's closed, but on the Yelp review right here, it says it's open right now. So Camaroncito local restaurant has a 1.3 star review on Yelp. This first review comes from Grace R. This is probably one of the worst restaurants I've ever been to. This place used to be really good and the food used to be very good. But now I can't even give him not even a one star. I'm an Uber Eats driver and they didn't even know what I was there for. So unorganized and the bathroom is really disgusting. Elba N said this is the worst restaurant. There's no way I can give a single star. The food is old and so expensive for something that is not worth it. This last one is from Missy L. I feel bad writing this, but when we spend $18 on five carne asada tacos and a drink, but end up with ground beef tacos, I don't feel bad anymore because I could have made that at home. Now these are some interesting reviews. We definitely felt nervous walking into this restaurant, but our curiosity just couldn't stop us from checking it out. And then we roll up and it looks like it's closed. You said you saw it closed? Yeah, the sign on it. See, but there's it a just... sign in that window that's like vertical dude it looks like we're gonna get shot <laughs> we're gonna get <laughs> shot all right let's go let's go see all right so here we are what oh, look this building dude, it's unsafe tree. structure unfit for human occupancy <laughs> <laughs> limit for human occupancy I'm like every door on this on this street so this whole building so, shut like, down oh shit <laughs> hobby <laughs> the building is shut down look at this door i go yeah i want to get some tacos it's, it's, it's <laughs> They'll stay open. Dude, it's closed. Stop work order. What is the chances of that? I have a feeling that some people like us are very lucky that there's a stop work order today. Dude, yeah. Rachel, where are you? Yo, someone cranked that. Someone cranked that side. You see that? It was probably the guy oh. on mess at the concert. Look at this truck right here. Oh, remote start. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I gotta do that. What this. happened? Butterfly doors coming soon. <laughs> so two days ago, this whole building was shut down for structural reasons. We had no idea. Very strong in here. Mm -hmm. freshy. Uh. <laughs> like bananas. You know what bananas smell like. I do indeed. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so the next location is Brown's Chicken. Now, all right, I heard Brown's Chicken is like a chain, like a fast food chain. It's got 1.7 stars at this location and there's 59 reviews, so we got some reading to do. Oh, That's man. just rubbing the salt in the wound and I was out there, I was, <laughs> so on our car ride over to Brown's Chicken, we read through some pretty terrible reviews. The first one is by David M. What the heck is this place? I have been going to Brown's my whole life. I walked in and they had music, Arabic music, blasting so loud we couldn't even hear the worker. Plus she was behind glass. Other customers came in and couldn't hear either. We only got the mushrooms and fritters, which tasted like funnel cakes. I was so disappointed in the vibe here, and I will have to look for another location. So disappointed. We then read Michael C's review. Zero stars. Absolutely horrible. Buffalo wings are a mouthful of oil and cheap horrible sauce. Tenders are a bland and white just horrible. Mac and cheese is macaroni and a melted block of Velveeta. One person is working the whole restaurant. One of the booths is unusable because of the way it's placed and they are playing YouTube Transformers videos. Don't come unless you want to try the worst restaurant in the area, which was a perfect calling for us. This next review was from Jessica R. If I could give this restaurant a negative review, I would. Literally the worst restaurant. When we arrived, nobody was at the restaurant. We waited over 45 minutes just to get our food. They were busy preparing their Grubhub orders. When we finally received our food, everything was cold. The chicken looked undercooked and the fries were still cold. Not to mention the restaurant was freezing cold. It was just overall disgusting from the food to the dirty dining area. They also made sure to tell us to give them a good review on Yelp, but hey, at least they threw in some free burnt breadsticks. And they attached these two pictures of breadsticks. Those look terrible. 
Now this review shocked us all and you'll see why. November 22nd of 2023, Wahid F left a review saying the food was terrible. It took forever to arrive. Don't come here, not recommended. Go to Dave's Hot Chicken number one. The service is slow, so congested and can find small space. LED lights on the window have the same flashing boring pattern. Worst place in existence, so cold and no heater. I would give this zero stars if I could. Terrible quality food, bathroom lights are broken, water is freezing, dirty stains in the restaurant. And he attached a picture of these dirty roof stains. I'm not gonna spoil it for you guys, but this last review by BBB was in June of 2022. Filthy and gross. Tables were all a mess. Men's washroom is closed and looks like it may be another year or two till they get to it. Tables were just full of food scraps. Unfortunately, it looked like there was one lady running the register and the kitchen, so that may be it. On the positive side, the chicken is some of the best I've ever had from any Browns. Golden, crispy, and delicious. And they serve Pepsi. So while they say curiosity killed the cat, we just hope that this food wouldn't kill us. You oh wait, is that hot up. bread? You're shitting me. No, yeah, look. Hot bread. Browns, chicken, and pasta. Oh shit, here we go, guys. <laughs> I've never eaten at a place probably less than like four stars. No way, he just saw a sign that says they do titles here. It does smell pretty, pretty decent. What, so what is she doing? Up. Rachel, what are you doing? All right, so let's it's figure out. Soon. Based on these reviews, I think we're gonna order the buffalo wings. It says they're full of oil and cheap horrible sauce. Some mac and cheese. That sounds good. So. Actually, I also want to order the stick of bread because that looks gonna rancid. It tastes better since 1940. Oh, dude, that's Mr. Brown. We've never been here before. Can you give us some advice on what you think we should order? Yeah, so do you want a chicken dinner with the sides or do you want to buy the stuff? Buffalo wings and mac and cheese? Yeah, let's do a bowl. Ooh, breadsticks, those look good. Yeah, let's have those. All right, we'll order breadsticks. And an order of corn fritters. One Pepsi and one orange crushed. I'll do an orange crushed too. Thank you. Come on, get in that booth. Come on, go in there. Boom. <laughs> How's the position? <laughs> Just like the review said, look, the bathroom. Please use women's bathroom because the bathroom. That was from over a year ago. Dude, the bathroom is still out of commission from over a year ago. They were right in the review. It's out of commission. Yeah. Oh, dude, the ceiling tile's still there. <laughs> yeah, it's hot as balls in here right now. So I guess the AC doesn't work in here. They got some pictures. You got some elephants? Is that the, the Sacagawea? Are you talking about the Statue of Liberty? Statue of Liberty. It's so long. I'm crying right now. <laughs> it doesn't seem that bad, but like the fact that the far the reviews have been like 99%, right? And there's still the one lady. Oh, yeah, there's just one lady working here. Because look at the situation of where we're sitting right now. <laughs> there's like no room next to the trash can. Everything is safe, but the. Yeah, that's right. That's fine, yeah. That's alright, no problem. They don't have macaroni cheese noodles. We're getting masa choni macaroni. Masaroni. <laughs> 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 $28. For this it better be good so i just want to mention that she said five minutes and it's probably been 15. yeah and it's hot as fuck in here i'm sweating Shit. special effects <laughs> thank you dun 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 it actually doesn't look bad it actually looks pretty fucking good these are the corn fritters so they they put it on the receipt as baked beans <laughs> put it they're corn fritters. the corn oh they break six breadsticks are burnt a little but that's not, not terrible that's not terrible on the bottom it's all dry it looks good to us <laughs> <laughs> sorry guys all right corn fritter Hot and funnel cake. Mm -hmm. Very salty funnel cake. It's not. I would eat those. They're good. Oh, right. Here's the corn. Cool. <laughs> A little charred. It's okay. No. In all of our bread. Bland bread. Dude, this looks like. My boy is special. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> Whoa. That's microwave. Yeah, that's out of a fucking can. It feels a lot of sauce. <coughs> the actual mac. No, it's actually masa choli. Oh yeah, right. masa choli. I think it's the first, the first bite. Mm -hmm. It's just tasty. Oh, I like that. You can okay. put syrup or something. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Like breakfast type thing. It's really juicy though. 
I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna lie. It's really good. It definitely, it definitely doesn't deserve a one. No. Like two, maybe one point nine. Two. I, I, but I bet you eat the whole thing. <laughs> 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 the big chunker. Oh yeah. yeah. The whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, please. <laughs> Oh, dude, it's so moist. Oh. These I, I can't, honestly. I don't know. I, that's... Oh, oh. Fucking juice. Denny! Oh, Denny! Oh, my God. It's all over your face. <laughs> <laughs> One last thing we have to do before we leave. Check the toilet. We gotta go in the bathroom. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Mold in the corners. Ugh. This is not good. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Honestly, now that we can talk outside. What Pakistan news? <laughs> oh, it is. Oh my god. That was rough, guys. Did you just see the bathroom? Dude, the bathroom was disgusting. The really? toilet seat yeah. was yellow. So, in all honesty, yeah. we had no idea when I picked the restaurants that this Brown's chicken was right next to the other one, Hot Breads. Let's go in there and check it out. Top quality Indian cuisine. <sighs> So as we headed to the next restaurant, Hot Breads, we thought that we'd sit outside and read through some reviews. The first review came from Simran S. They began by explaining that they catered from them on May 5th and the food got everybody sick. The naan was sweet, messed up their party completely, and to please think a thousand times before you order your food from this place. They called and notified the owner and he didn't care if the party was ruined or not, but the food is disgusting. Everybody had diarrhea, whoever ate at my party. This one came from Truth T. I'm living in Chicago for 30 years. Never seen such a bad place. Service is horrible. When I went there, one guy was taking phone orders, attending to dine-in customers, going inside to bring food from kitchen and packing the food. Apart from serving food for dine-in customers, frequently he was running the kitchen and returned empty-handed. I had a doubt whether he was also cooking the food in the kitchen. In that chaos, he messed up everybody's order and few customers were seen shouting at the multitask expert. I ordered Medu Vada, and I was served two pieces of stale cold cutlets. Further scrutiny revealed the fact that they were actually vadas. I am avoiding the word Medu as the word means soft. The black round bricks, aka Vada, saved a trip for me to the dentist, as one of my tooth that was to be removed came off with one single bite. Never in my life I have ever seen a Vada in dark brown color. Stay away from this place. This place does not have air conditioning, and it seems the place will be shut down very soon. They are pushing all the old cutlets to the customers in the name of Medu Vada and pissing off the neighborhood dental surgeons. Terrible experience and waste of my hard-earned dollars. Now that was enough to scare us into leaving, but again, we decided to give it a chance, and here's how it went. Thank you. Can we try three of your recommended dishes? It could be anything. What is your favorite things? Yeah, yeah to go. Crepe, it's a salty crepe. Salty crepe. And it's uh, stuffed with potatoes, if you want it. Okay. So, yeah, let's do it. I have a shot of chicken in it. <laughs> <laughs> this is basically more of southern part South of India. India. South, South India. India. South India. India. Okay. In India, I don't know how much you know, in India, Different states, they have different, different recipes, different languages, food, different, different, food, different, different, different tastes. Tastes. Really? Yeah. Wow. Thank you. Look at the cakes. Yeah, there's a lot of cakes and like fresh pastries up there. Yeah, peaches. First impressions? Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's not terrible. It's hot as fuck in here again. Cool. I'm clammy, I'm clammy. Cool. Yeah, I'm clammy. Yeah. We're cool. <laughs> so we got Choli, Choli Batura, Vijawara, Boneless Dum Biryani and masala dosa we paid 35 dollars and 81 cents for this you better like and subscribe and comment <laughs> so they have four tv screens up there and nothing has the menu on it <laughs> a hole in the ceiling yeah right there is a hole in the ceiling yeah <laughs> shit sorry yeah, okay. You should have told him to follow us on YouTube. Yeah. We'll follow you on YouTube. Not get shot. Oh. Got the yellow smiley face on it. You know it's gonna be good. It looks like beans. All I know is. Oh no! <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> hey, panini. <laughs> Dude, what the? <laughs>
fuck is that? Dude, I'm so scared, guys. <laughs> What's in there? Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's potato, no? Oh, yeah, it's potato on the inside. <laughs> this is like a mini meatball. All right, here we go. Dude, no. There's no way in hell I'm eating this. It's like a chickpea. Oh, it's spicy a little bit. Yeah, you can go for seconds on that one. I ain't doing that. Oh my god. They got a rabbit oh, back no. there that just plopped that up. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Dude, it's like chickpeas. The flavor is not terrible. It's the spicy. texture is like... Yeah, the texture is not great, guys. I'm not a fan of this. You, you want some help? No, no, no. No, he's good? Alright. So we are also donating all of this food to the dumpster. <laughs> Wait, there's another one of these, have? Nah, no, fuck. I don't know what it is, though. Just... Oh, you're fucking... <laughs> Oh, dude, what is that? It looks like I'm puking a cup. Is it just soup? Yeah, that's all you do. <laughs> dude, you're kidding. What is it, though? I don't know. Come on. Uh, Come on. Yeah, I think it's potato. Hey, why don't you try Come on. Why don't you <laughs> the potato? They won't even try it with me, guys. It's an onion. Oh, no. That's an onion? I'm out. I'm out. Oh, my God, the texture. Hobby, you need to try it. No, chalky soup. Try a little bit. You have to. Come on. We don't get this opportunity again. I'm, I'm happy with that, that's fine. Oh my god. Yes. You're, dick, dude. You're like, yeah, no. Come on, Reese. Just a little bit. <laughs> Wait, you can't the sauce is actually good. The sauce is not bad. I'll give it the sauce. It's just a texture. The texture everything. is like, not... <laughs> Come on, you got it. The aftertaste looks kind of good. Oh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> you have to... How, you have no! To I'm not, no, I don't do cooked onions this, that big. This big, oh. <laughs> this big ass chunk is a big onion. Square, bro. It's a... <laughs> <laughs> it, it smells like a, it's like it's like a pancake. Yeah, <laughs> it's like a potato filling. <laughs> Dude, this guy's ballsy, bro. That's not terrible, actually. It's just like a. What is it's it? It's a very potatoy it? pancake. It's a potato. Yeah, it's some breading on there too. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> Not bad, actually. That's pretty good. I, I could have a fucking Choliani pancake. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we have an aftertaste. It's good after. No? Yes? No. The yeah, aftertaste, right? Weird it aftertaste. Like pee. Yeah, the aftertaste is like pee. Wait, how do you guys know what pee tastes like? Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys doing in that trailer? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> I go camping and we don't taste pee. <laughs> well, you know. Wrong joke or what? Uh, I was gonna say, I don't know if I actually really want you want to take this home? I'm fucking gotta give it a good taste, you know? <laughs> oh, you guys' bathroom's gonna smell like... <laughs> I'm trying to dive into Indian culture. Yeah, we'll see about the next one, <laughs> see if you'll die. You're supposed to take this, rip off a piece, then use this to scoop oh, up Oh, is that rice. called naan? Yeah, I think is that, so. Is that... No! Is that Come on, please be the first edible thing. Onions. Shit, sorry. Mm. Yeah, see, that smells. My my friend wants to that one for sure. It smells like a little bit of Mexican. <laughs> it smells alright, dude. It's it's kind of way too I strong. Smell really, here. really strong smell. Mm. And this is just an egg. I'm assuming it's just an egg. Half an egg. <laughs> Half an egg. Oh, dude, it looks like someone's just <laughs> shit in a cup. That's sauce. That's not... I'll take mm. Chick chickpeas again. That cucumber sauce? So oh, I know. Oh! Like for the I've gyro? had this before. Yeah, for the gyro, right? Like it's like yeah. a. Um, I don't know if that's. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, oh, that's yeah, we added. No, no. No, I don't. That doesn't oh, no. It's not the smell. Let's give this a try. Oh, shit, there's chicken at the bottom, dude. Yo, get a good bite. Get some chicken at the bottom. A little bit of rice or. I don't even think it's rice. That's like. Oh, dude, it has that, that curry smell. <laughs> oh, here we go. Dude, the, the sauces are just not it. Right, the right fucking like mixture. Yeah, but like would be that sauce not. is disgusting. The sauce is gross. Like the but like that rice shit, whatever that is. That's just pretty good. Yeah, like the stuff that looks like noodles. That looks pretty good. That tastes pretty good. When you get but, down to the you, this <laughs> <laughs> my car. It's pretty good. I need to take them to my cookouts because this shit ain't happening. <laughs> At the very bottom, there's like these chunks of I don't know if it's chicken. It, it, it's chicken biryani, so. It, I guess it is here, Rachel. You didn't try your chicken yet. I am. Open up. Open your mouth. No, don't. Nah, she might need to do this kind of yeah. strong taste. Strong right. taste. Oh, shit. <laughs> I can't reach. Give it a chance. Give it a chance before you spit it out. Five seconds, five seconds. One. <laughs> <laughs> she turned into the fucking actress. 
Can we get a replay on that one? Swallow. Don't spit. <laughs> no, no, dude. Just spit it out. Spit it out. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, da, da, da. What is this now? Yeah, I know. I know what's this. <laughs> Alright, Abby. Have a taste of that. Mmm. Not... You're weird, bro. You're built for this, bro. Mmm. Mm. So there's white sauce. It looks like it has some strands of cucumber. I'm gonna do it the way that, um, you know, is culture appropriated. There's a bread with the white cream on. Oh, he's squirting the lemon. Dude, the it's line. Just fucking warm. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> just, it's just how it's meant to be eaten. Yeah. We're gonna have this all at the same time. This looks gas. <gasps> Sorry, Hub. Eat it, eat it. Oh, oh, dude, get the bag. Get the fucking bag, please. That's so gross. <laughs> no. There's no napkin, dog. Mm. <laughs> Just be It looks really gross going in your mouth, but. Boom. Mm hmm. Nah, you're bullshit. The mixture of all the flavors? That shit, not bad. Hold on, you gotta try that now. No. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna eat this. No, we ain't, we're going to Portillo's. Is what we're doing. <laughs> this is what Rachel said I have to do. Is I take oh, this. Oh, dude, you're gonna make such and, like, a mess. And I, I do Danny, that. That's pure onion. And then you. Oh. Mm. Fuck me to tears, bro. Oh my god. Oh. Is it good? You no. probably tasted onion. No. no. Oh. My god. oh. I don't know, try it. You gotta do the full experience, motherfucker. <laughs> it's like, probably just. It's like a fucking tongue. The face <laughs> I'm gonna go out on a limb and say this cucumber white sauce is supposed to I don't think so. go on here. That's gonna make it taste better. I got this, dude. I know. You guys are a bunch of wusses. This is some good food. This is healthy. This is. from India. No, bro, what, is, what was that? Bag fucking... is right there. Did you just gag, dude? Yeah. <laughs> fucking like, dude, open this bag. My thing is, open the kids, why open is the inside bag. of the meat blood red? <laughs> I'm okay without ever having this again. I feel like if we were born into this, we'd love it. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, you're right. But since we're not uh, used to eating it, dude, no uh, fucking way you're about to do what I think you're gonna do. The potato pancake is good. <laughs> so here comes the last part of the video, guys, where we are gonna rate the restaurants we visited. Unfortunately, the first one was closed down because of a structural failure. That fucking portion. <laughs> <laughs> so the first restaurant that we tried, Brown's Chicken. The corn fritters were really good there. Honest opinion. Oh. What is your rating on Brown's Chicken? Just don't microwave food. Like, yeah, you're gonna sell it to people. A don't micro microwave. Yeah, microwave mac and cheese. That's the reason cheese. why it was so gooey. Yeah. yeah. If it was like fresh, it would have been good. I think any of that shit if it was fresh. It would have been good. <laughs> I gotta give Brown's like a like a two. What what was it? It was a one. one yeah, it's like a one point something. I I, I think it, it's right on par, man. Maybe a two, two point five. Maybe a little bit better than what it says online. Out of five. Out of ten. It's a five star rating, dude. Oh. <laughs> I'll give it a one point eight five. One point eight five. One. Wow, the critic. Honest rating on the hot breads. Hot bread. Hot girls broads. <laughs> I would never eat it because this is not what I like. Is was it like the presentation was nice for the biryani? It tastes good. That rice shit, that was pretty, that was decent. Dude, the sauce. Yeah, the sauce, the sauce is, the sauce is bad. I'll give it a 2.5. I just, I don't know. It's just salt, it's very sour tasting. Sour. But well, that's what they're used to. All right guys, that's gonna wrap up this video. That was rough. We're gonna go get some portillos, some real food. If you guys like this video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you guys wanna see next. So let's back shots out. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys later.